alien update this right here is going to have secret alien messages on it and then aliens are going to invade the game again just like they did last april 1st what's going on for the guys? welcome back to a brand new roblox jailbreak video my name is creek and today guys today we're in roblox jailbreak because the long awaited alien military area 51 update has come out guys and in this video i'm going to be showing you guys everything you need to know in the update every single easter egg every single detail every single thing including planes and uh, military secrets alien weapons snipers all that good stuff so be sure to stay tuned to the end of the video so you don't miss anything all right so the update finally came out it was supposed to come out on on Saturday night but it got delayed until Sunday morning and then it got delayed until Sunday night and then it came out Sunday afternoon so who knows but here it is right here guys this is the alien area 51 military base now this is what was added in the game but before we get into this I do want to go over the patch notes so if we go on over to the jailbreak game and go to the about section here are the official notes in the description there's a new military base in the desert there's a new military gel arrested with a high bounty you'll be sent here to escape requires 5k or higher bounty the base is protected by a force field using alien technology sneak into a police station and wear a police outfit to get through and new sandstorms now appear in the desert when it rains so there's actually a big problem with that guys sandstorms aren't in the game okay what's supposed to happen is whenever the game uh, it starts raining in the game a sandstorm is supposed to happen inside of jailbreak it's supposed to look a lot like this here but well guys that's i don't know what happened because it's literally not in the game i i've went in so many different servers i've went in so many vip servers it's not in the game there is no sandstorm let me know down in the comment section if you guys have seen a sandstorm because i haven't seen it i've went in you know when it's raining i've went in when it's not raining i went in when it's night i went in when it's day there's no sandstorm so i don't know what's going on with that but let me know down below if you guys have seen one because i have not seen one but anyway let's get into this base guys all right so in order to get in you're going to need to either be a police officer or you're going to need to be uh or get the police officer clothing if you're a criminal and you're not a police officer and you want to know how to get in basically you're going to need a key card you're going to have to sneak in to any police base on the map there's one in the prison and there's one right here and what you're going to do you're going to come back here to the back and you're going to click on the police uniforms you can do the SWAT one or you can do the regular police one now once you have those on I know my character doesn't actually show outfits but trust me they're on there you can then get into the base so there's two doors into the base there's one on this side right here and then there's one on this side right here we'll go in through this one so how it works is quite simple once we have the outfit on or if you're police you just walk up to it the force field disables and well okay it, <laughs> it re-enabled uh the force field disables you walk in doors open up and you walk right in now be careful with the doors because if you touch those it will oof you because that's barbed wire and then once you're in well let's oh man there's a lot going on here so right off the bat on the left guys i just want to show you guys this cool little easter egg there's literally like a little platypus right here like a little air force platypus now i know it's not a platypus it's actually a uh, what is this thing I, a weasel or something like that now what's interesting guys about this is this right here this is gonna be the tower for the airport and for the uh the airplane and the reason why we know that is that right there is an aircraft controller uh, hat that he's wearing right there. So that is literally a plane uh, air traffic controller hat that that little dude is wearing right there. So planes confirm. All right, but let's talk about this big thing. So right here in the middle of the game, I'm actually going to turn this down because it does make a little bit of a noise there, is the force field generator. Now, there's a bunch of ooze coming out the bottom of it, and it has like little, you know, like alien lightning coming off of it. Now, if you punch it, you can actually disable it, which disables the force field for a few seconds, allowing literally anyone to fly in, drive in, or get in. It does take a few punches for it to disable, but there it goes. It makes a little like farting noise, and then it just kind of disables. And after a while, it'll re-enable. You can see through it, which looks pretty cool cool and it shoots like a little beacon in the sky i'm not sure if you can see it it's kind of faint right now but at night time you can really see it that's the force field right here is an empty hangar probably going to be like some sort of tank or plane that spawns in here here's a helipad right here and guys okay let's just talk about it right here up front okay the airplanes check this out this is an airplane runway obviously and it says coming soon on it c-o-m i-n-g 
And then S O O N coming soon. Airplanes are coming soon. I'm willing to bet probably the next update or two airplanes are going to be in the game and they're going to spawn right here at the military base. Now, if we make our way right on over here to the war room, uh, you have to actually have a key card to get in these. So keep that in mind or be a police officer. Obviously, this is where the weapons are and a giant map of jailbreak. So in here, you can press E to grab any weapon you want. All the weapons in the game are here. You got the Uzi over here. You do still have to buy them if you don't have them you do need to buy them but right here in the middle guys is oh i didn't notice this those actually are little uniforms over here that's pretty cool but right here guys we have a giant jailbreak map and this thing is really really cool you can see everything on here here's the museum here's the uh the military base area 51 i'm just gonna call it area 51 here's the uh the prison right here the mountains the little like village over here pretty cool little map it'd be cool if you could see where all the players were on it but unfortunately you can't do but the but that's that's the war room right there now if we go out and go along here this is the most wanted prison this is the area 51 high containment prison now if you have a bounty over 5,000 this is where you're going to come to so if you get arrested with a $5,000 bounty you're going to end up here in one of these cells now I've looked at all the cells there's no like secret alien stuff or anything like that in here it's all pretty much just like a normal jailbreak cell they just copied and pasted it over is what happened but here it is it's just a little bit harder to get out through here because there's a lot of lasers obviously there's going to be a police here too so it's going to be pretty difficult to get out of this thing you know in one piece no another interesting thing right here are there's some plane tires right here next to the flagpole um i have looked it up these are indeed plane tires and along with the flagpole you can actually climb to the top of it much like you can in you know military movies and games like that they climb the flagpole for like exercising i just fell down you can climb the flagpole which is pretty awesome now this is the big one guys the top secret research room check this out so right here this is where the new ufo spawns if you want to get the ufo in the game this is where it spawns it still costs five hundred thousand dollars but it flies as fast and as high as a helicopter now obviously they were pretty uh underpowered and kind of sucky before but they buffed them they fly just as high as uh, as helicopters do, and they fly just as fast. So UFOs are probably even better than helicopters now. And of course, we can fly right back on down here. The force field will disable, and we can just fly right back. Can we get back in? I don't think we can get back in, but we can park it right here on the runway. And then if we go back in here, something really else that's interesting is it says coming soon on the back wall. Now, if you guys didn't know, this right here is a weapon wall, meaning that alien weapons are going to be coming to jailbreak in a future update. If you don't believe me that this is a weapon wall, all you got to do, go right back on over here to the war room and you will see the exact same textured wall as right there. Here it is right here. Here's the weapons. And if you go right back on over here, it's the exact same texture wall, meaning we're going to get some secret alien weapons, maybe like a sniper. That's what I would be suspecting here, like a ray gun or something like that right here on this wall. Down here, we have like some alien goo, maybe like Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. No idea, to be honest with you. Nothing else in here other than the UFO for right now and uh that's the little like secret top secret research facility and then around the back of the top secret research facility is the meteor here now what's really interesting about this is obviously you have the goo that's spreading along the ground but there's also particles it's like the uh the actual like meteor here is disintegrating into the ground a few of my viewers in, in a live stream has commented and said that this is actually a lot smaller than it used to be meaning that this is shrinking and dissolving into the ground and you can see the particles kind of just like flying up there there's actually a uh, a supply drop that got caught on the force field that's actually really funny but uh yeah no idea what's going on here we got particles flying in the sky no idea but it's very likely guys obviously the next update is going to be the area 51 update in jailbreak it's pretty obvious that aliens are going to be invading in area 51 and if you don't believe me check this out so guys if you go on over here to the fbi base we got a really big deal and i left this for the end of the video because it's a big deal okay this is a big big thing so if you go into the fbi base you guys probably remember i've been talking about these tvs and how they've been changing the past few updates and everyone's like Cree crap you crazy well guess what guys i'm not crazy check this out right here guys we have static TVs, all right? These TVs used to be turned off, then it used to be a blue screen, and now with this update, it has static on it, like it's receiving some sort of image. It's not like this in the prison, it's just right here at the FBI base, and I can guarantee you, here's what's gonna happen, guys. For the April 1st alien update, 
this right here is going to have secret alien messages on it and then aliens are going to invade the game again just like they did last april 1st obviously that's not confirmed that's just my guess obviously in a week you can come back here and tell me how right i was but i guarantee you there's going to be some secret alien messages popping up on this tv probably throughout the week leading up to april 1st really really exciting stuff hopefully we even have like aliens walking around in the game that would be kind of cool because you know we don't really have npcs in the game so little aliens flying around and stuff would be really awesome Awesome. Now, one last thing I do want to talk about here is you can't actually get into the actual like uh, little control towers here. You can climb up in them. A lot of people don't know this. You can climb up here and uh, defend the base. Obviously, you know, the force field catches your, your bullets so you can't like shoot out of it unless someone's coming in. But if there's a prisoner coming in or something, you can uh, stay up here to, uh, to, defend, to defend your homeland and defend your base. You can get into every single one of these towers. Uh, that one right there you can do the ones back here you can do i don't think this one in the back right there you can get into i could be wrong but i'm pretty sure you can't get into this one but all the other ones you can get into and yeah that's pretty much this update here i wish sandstorms were actually in the game i'm pretty sure they're just completely broken right now but uh yeah i'm really excited guys april 1st update is going to be coming out within a week actually one week from now is april 1st so we're gonna get an alien invasion i'm like 99 sure i'm right on the secret alien message stuff let me know what you guys think down below Low. as always if you guys are new go ahead and subscribe hit the bell icon turn on your notifications and that way you'll be notified of all future videos live streams everything we do here on the channel and if you enjoyed this video hit the like button on your way out and um yeah guys let's do a vault safe giveaway so as always guys in my face right there as always guys in every single jailbreak video i give away a free vault safe to one of you guys so that's what we're gonna do right here in this video if you want to win one all you gotta do is be subscribed and leave a comment down below with your roblox name let's give one to christian here here's her name right there let's go ahead and give her a vault say bada bing bada boom and uh yeah if you guys want to win one all you gotta do type your roblox name down in the comment section below and be subscribed there you go chris i hope you enjoy that but yeah guys i think that's pretty much it for this roblox jailbreak update like i said before be subscribed all that awesome stuff we're gonna have a lot more future videos on jailbreak and this awesome alien update coming out in the future over the next like week it's gonna be really hype gonna be awesome i'll be live streaming today 6 p.m est make sure to stop by we'll be checking out the new update all that cool stuff and uh yeah thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you guys in the next video bye